Good morning, watch fans. So what we're looking at here, this is the oldest thing in my collection. 1920s ladies wristlet. Wristlets were really 1850s, pre-turn of the century, but uh, I think this qualifies. Ultra small, ultra compact, gold, rubies, and diamonds. The only markings on the dial says, it says um, Lucerne, but Lucerne was not a brand name ever, from what I can tell. It was just a name they put on there for generic uh, Swiss movements inside. 10 karat rolled gold, I believe, rolled gold plate. So um, probably wasn't a very expensive watch. You know, my family was fairly fairly middle to low class at that point in time. We haven't really gotten much better than that. But uh, anyways, <laughs> uh, you know, it's uh, it was a gift. It was her wedding watch. She got married in 1920 or 1921. And this was the gift from her husband. My great grandfather, I'm sorry, my grandfather Jackson Fitz Randolph. And he married Jesse Lindsay, I believe is her maiden name. Yeah, Jesse Lindsay. And um, in California, 1921, I believe, 1920, 21. And they had four kids and three survived to adulthood. So, uh, pretty cool watch. Can't find much about it. A lot of these are made. A lot of these little teeny watches are made. As you can tell, you know, as compared to, uh, here's a tape measure. This is a one centimeter mark on a tape measure. And so, you know, it's pretty small. Here's an inch mark. It's a one inch mark. So it's, you know, three quarters of an inch across, a little less. Yeah, it's about three quarters of an inch across. Maybe oh a centimeter and a half. Yeah, a centimeter and a half across approximately. You can see it. Very small watch. Very small watch. So pretty cool. You know, um, not much to say about this thing other than it keeps time. I put a wind on it. And you can feel the stop when you wind it. You get about six or seven good turns and you can feel the stop. I set the time a little bit ago. And it's keeping fairly good time. It's keeping you know, within within several minutes, you know, a day. I'm going to guess it's plus or minus five minutes a day. That's pretty close. Pretty neat. And um, this is probably the uh, the oldest watch I'll ever have. Pretty cool. You guys have a great one. I'll catch you on the next one.